Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Copy that. All backup Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there. What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well, the suspense is killing me. It's Dad, he wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So, so what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. find a couch for your yard one day. Ooh, K. 
careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Yeah, okay. It's Friday. Thanks for making me smoke again. Oh, then I'll make sure you don't smoke any weed tonight. Deal? <laughs> Deal. <laughs> Can't wait to see you baked as hell trying to pull this off. <sighs> Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa! What the hell are don't you doing? Don't move! You're my human post-it note. First, we need money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All right. Blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C-O-N-D-O... Oh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Whoa, good drawing, Lila. Daniel's teacher would be proud of you. Ha! The pretentious artist has spoken. Don't fall asleep before me tonight, or you might see more of my skills. <laughs> you wish. <sighs> These fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. I should change us so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me? Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> No way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure. But I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said... Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, oh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey! No fair. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go. Uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletail. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz. Be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco?
crisp. Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week. Or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. Daniel is innocent, and so the jury gives him the Choco Crisp. Oh, yeah. I win. <laughs> okay. Back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Hey, hey, I have to go to work in my room, too. <laughs> yeah? Don't hurry back. Okay, let's get this party list started. Do not enter, ever. Trust me, Dad, I won't. Every Christmas, Dad wants to watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy with us. Every Christmas, Dad wants to watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy with us. That's cool. Man, is there any more boring sport than baseball? <laughs> but, geez, how old is this? We've had it since I was ten. I don't know who plays more, Daniel or Dad. Daniel spends hundreds of hours yelling into the mic playing Minecraft with Noah. Dad hates sushi. But he orders it anyway for us. I'm not that into cars, but these are pretty bitching. I don't know who plays more, Daniel or Dad. Better pack for the party. All right, Dad. Can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Well, of course. He asked Daniel, too. Dad said we could go to Mount Baker this year. The trails are insane. How long is he going to keep all this shit? Dad should just sell that other bike. That you, Sean? Yeah. Yeah. Don't get too excited, kid. You're making me nervous. Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure, can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, uh, shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. <sighs> Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on.
Hey, I got it. I think. Hmm. <laughs> Wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter. Hey, did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about... Is that it? Yes. This is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. You always say that. But for what? <laughs> so you deadbeats can take care of me when I retire. <sighs> You'll never retire. Someday. Then maybe back to Mexico. Back to Puerto Lobos. Oh, I've heard this one before. Mm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Ugh, oh, come on. It's wicked. I'm just not used to driving. You better get used to it, or you'll be taking your date to prom on the number 30 bus. Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. He's mine. He doesn't even know what cock-blocking is. He looks up to you, Sean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way. Ha! Huh. I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? Ah, 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 shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Um, I mean. Yeah, probably. But. We'll be partying at a house, and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? All right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh. Okay, have fun, but not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood, even though he won't tell. He was so proud to get that. He should be. Damn. The guy never stops working. <laughs> At least I don't have to help Daniel out with math. Thanks, Dad. Come on, open up. Why? <gasps> because. Okay, okay. 
What are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? Thanks for giving me the choco crisp. <laughs> That's what big brothers are for. Sometimes. What's with the scissors? Can't tell you. It's a big secret. So don't come in. Okay, fine. Don't tell me. After all, I'm only your big brother. Who looks after you and takes care of you. <sighs> Stop it. All I can say is... Watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is going to be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will I love you there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. <sighs> Did she ask about me? <sighs> I'm sorry, dude. She's cheating on you. Shut up! And I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Of course you do. Daniel's always up to something. Wonder what's next. How many times have I watched it? Not enough. How many times have I watched it? Not enough. How many times have I watched it? Not enough. Couldn't live without this shit. Time to get in the mood for tonight. That would be sick to just go tag the world. I really like that one. <laughs> I don't totally suck. Thanks, Daniel. I'll uh, treasure this gift always. We'll never make varsity at this rate. I told them not to take a picture of me after the race. I look like a sweaty pig. Daniel, I should practice instead of putting it up here. But it looks pretty rad. Promise me to follow what I say, whatever it takes. I think I know what to ask for Christmas. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. Blue light. Oh, hi, Gunther. Sorry. You stay hidden here. Huh. <sighs> Not sure Danny was ready to be an uncle yet. We got these for free during sex ed last year. Damn, we still have like 10 books left in the series. I won't finish until I'm 20. <laughs> Lila was belting out so hard during that show. She lost her voice for a week. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Okay. Don't be a stalker, Sean. Man. Oh my god, the internet was a mistake. Very funny, Lila. Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. That would be sick to just go tag.
dragged the world. I really like that one. <laughs> I don't totally suck. Thanks, Daniel. I'll uh, treasure this gift always. Lila will survive if I take five to practice my drawing. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Daniel kept saying, I'm freezing, but we couldn't get him off the skis. Don't forget the non-boost. This will work. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. Okay, better take that instead. <laughs> Man, Daniel could live off this crap. Cross that off the list. Drinks down, food to go. You're coming with me. Mm. Maybe this is better. What the? Is Dad baking something? Meet the Diaz, organization experts. I can spare a few bucks for next week's pizza night. things go well, should I bring Jen back here? Maybe Dad won't like her, or she won't like him. Or worse, she can get along with Daniel. Dude, stop. I'm not even dating her. Yet.
It's nice going jogging with Dad every once in a while. Though he's way too chatty. Gotta get that love blanket. Even if I don't hook up with Jen, at least I'll be warm. Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. Daniel destroyed our old nativity scene. Sorry, baby Jesus. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Finally, ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. boy just give me a minute gee where did I put the mm, hold on <sighs> okay hi did you get everything on your hand list it's all in my backpack yeah dad hooked me up with some cash so we're set for the night in case we need anything else or if you and Jen need anything else Ooh la la. <sighs> okay serious talk what are you gonna say to Jen tonight well I don't know, play it cool, talk about the gig last week, get to know her tastes. Oh, oh my god, you did rehearse your moves for tonight. You're totally into her. Duh, why do you think I'm freaking out? She's so super cool. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean, into you. Sean, I'm done, look. I made zombie blood. It's, um, corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just uh, Just bugging the uh, shit out what? of me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, but... I know. <sighs> anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? <sighs> but... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. He's not always cute. You would sound like me, too, if you lived with him. Anyway. You wouldn't be so uptight if you got laid. And maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Oh shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it up. It might get your attention. Let me see Not that drawing. taking a look at her picture. Um uh, nah, sorry. It's too good for your eyes. <laughs> Whatever. Wait until I draw you tonight and show it to Jen. Whoa, Not taking her hair. Picture. Whoa, indeed. 
I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh, you will see. <laughs> I see you, Sean. Should we set the wedding date now? Hey, come on. It's just a heart. I like her hair, okay? No big deal. Sure. Why is Derek Anderson all over Jen's profile? He's an asshole. Better be nice. They're like best friends, stalker. Really? Oh. In that case, I'll spare him. Dude, she already likes you. Don't blow it. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey! Look at my shirt, asshole! What's the big deal? It's Halloween! Don't ever touch my brother! You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt. Look! I told you, it was an accident. You better leave us alone. Oh, yeah. Go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Dude, did you get that blood on him? Uh, uh, it was... It was an accident. I swear. He's a fucking retard. See what happens when you don't listen? Dad told you to stay in the yard. I know, I know, Sean. I was just acting like a zombie and I forgot. I swear. I swear. Where? Take the little baby back to his crib. Come on, Daniel. We're done. Yeah, go back to daddy. Pussies. No wonder your mom bailed on you. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! Get inside, now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <laughs> you and your whole fucking family are going to jail! Losers! What? Oh, What's going on? me! Daniel, get over here! Sean! Did he get hurt? Okay! Okay, step away! Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating it. up my little brother! Now! Hands behind your Sean. head! Sean! This is fucking bullshit! Oh, no. Sean, what's Get happening? On the Sir! Dad. We didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. I'll be Sean, shot. listen. Oh. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. I want to go home. They're good kids, officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. I said don't move. They didn't Daddy, do anything. It's going to be all right. On the ground.
No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being being at home or or in your room. This is a a real adventure, right? So come on. Let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you. Okay? Okay. But I am so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know. I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome possum. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, a Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We can be wolves. Yeah. Yeah, that, that works. Just work on that howl. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once, huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no. run! You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! Blah!
that sign? Are we there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry, too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Hope the driver isn't around watching us. What is that? What do you find? Check it out. There's a chunky chocolate crisp bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love chocolate crisp bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please? Get one when we stop next, please. I promise. Yeah! And you can wash it down with a frosty root beer later, okay? But I'm starving. Just don't eat me. Welcome to Nowhere, Washington. Yay. Now we can see where we are. Whew. There's a river nearby. A river? Are we gonna go swimming? No. Duh. It's way too cold for us. Let's just hope that doesn't happen to anybody. Okay. <sighs> I don't know. I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us? And they're hunters. You're too little to hunt. We're cool. Daniel! Check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze. And people used to put them up to give directions. Like GPS? <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. If only Dad was here. Come on, Daniel. The sun is going down. <sighs> okay, dude. Do you have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. Uh, well, maybe I'll go. But don't let me get stuck in there. Don't worry. I'll call the forest plumbers if you fall in. Especially after you use it. Oh, man. I'm Sean. Look how big these trees are. Eh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they... Uh, attack us? Aren't you Mr. Minecraft? I thought you loved the forest. I watched you build giant cities out of logs. I did. I built the biggest cities ever. Ooh. I can use my axe to chop up some wood. Then we can build a secret base. Well, 
Sounds like you're ready for the woods. Lead the way. Whoa. That place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. <sighs> I don't think Daniel understands what's going on. I can't tell him the truth now. I just can't. Dad always knew exactly where to go. He was a living compass. What does that one say? It says to go right. Man, what are we doing out here? Huh. The river must be a bit further. Man, what are we doing out here? Huh. The river must be a bit further. Let's take a look around. Hey, Sean. We I don't found have much. Can I taste one? This please? is better than nothing. Not these ones. Come on. I'm starving. One won't hurt. You don't have much. This is better than nothing. Yeah, it could. You better listen to me. Man, if I had a woody hat, we could build a city out of this forest. I'll leave that to the zombies. We're not that desperate yet. People write some stupid shit sometimes. This is stupid. Just like the trails Dad used to take me on. Just like the trails Dad used to take me on. Sean. Let's just hope that doesn't happen while we're here. <sighs> Damn. I'm so tired. It feels like we're walking nowhere. How am I supposed to take care of us out here? I don't even know what happened back there. To that cop. Or Danny. How can Dad be... Whoa. Look at that. Yeah. So cool. Never seen you get so jacked up over a nice view before. So? I've never seen anything like this. Never, ever! Yeah. I guess you haven't. I remember when... Dad... I wish Dad was here with us. Well, thanks. Not cooling up anymore? Yes, you're super cool. But... I just wish the family was together. At home. It'll be cool to watch a movie and get a pizza. I need ice cream. Dude, stop. I told you we have to keep going. We'll see that later. And right now, it's just you and me. Okay? Yeah. It's our park. We can do whatever we want. That's right. So, we better go build a, a secret base so we can hide out for the night. Are you ready? Yes. I can build anything. We just have to find some cool blocks around here. And be careful of creepers. Okay. Let's go.
shark. Let's play hide and seek. Bet you can't find me. No, not right now. We stick together. Uh, you're no fun. Not today, I'm not. Sorry. Whatever. I bet nobody knows what they mean anymore. What does that one say? Whoa. Sean, did you see that? Here, kitty kitty. Here, kitty kitty. Oh. Hey, I think this path leads to the river. Coming! What if the raccoon came with us? He could be our pet. Oh, man, raccoons are not a pet. We have to watch out for skeletons and zombies. Um, this is pretty high up. Uh, Sean? Come on. I got you. <clears throat> Phew. Thanks. Uh, you see that? Looks like a clicker. Creepy. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that? Ugh, I should have listened in biology class. Daniel! I got you! Dude, you struck out. That did not scare me. Liar, liar! I saw your face! That was, uh, surprise. Maybe you scared me for like one second. <laughs> I got you, I eat you. Don't mess with the zombie. I bet Dad would play with me. Ooh. Looks like a cave. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. For what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there. I don't know. Uh, come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm. We could fight off any skeletons or creepers with some good traps. <laughs> cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? Right. Yes! 
so what do we need? Uh, you know, shit to make a fire. Um, twigs, branches. Are you sure we can do this? Who can stop us? Nobody. <sighs> okay. Let's unpack. Finally. Coming! Hey, John, let's have a race. Whoever finds three logs is the winner. Cool? Okay. You're brave to challenge me. So let's do it. No way you're gonna beat me. I wish Noah was out here with me. We could build a fort. Now this is perfect. Yes, here's number two. Ooh, Daniel is in it to win it. Nice and dry. That's enough for a toasty fire. All right, how much you got? It's all there. Yeah, okay. That should be enough for the night. <laughs> See, told you, I won. All right, we have a little time to explore before we light up the fire. Cool, I'll go check the river. Man, this place is like our own giant camp. We should catch some fish for dinner. Fish, fish. Come out, fish, fish. Feels good to focus on something after all that shit. Stop moving so much. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. I 
dad was here, he'd catch every fish. Rocks and water. I ooh. Rocks and water. I have a good idea. Hey, what are you doing, Sean? Can I try? You've never skipped stones? <sighs> yeah. But it was a long time ago with Dad. <laughs> okay. Then show me. Watch me. Dude, come on. That's a boulder, not a rock. Here, you need a flat rock. Hold it like this. Look at my hand. Boom. Okay, I did it. My turn. Hold it with your thumb and finger, and spin your wrist when you throw. Don't worry, man. The current's just too strong here. We'll try on a lake next time. Deal? Deal. He thinks we're just going on a trip. I can't imagine when he'll find out what really happened. Uh, who are you? Who are we fighting? Skeleton with flame arrows? Watch out! Oh, close call. Now it's our turn. Ah, right into a skull. We are awesome. Damn right. Thanks for having my back. Now that... <laughs> You're safe, little bro. Spiders hibernate in the fall. Good. I remember when you pushed me into that web. Hey, that was a long time ago. You got me back, right? Yeah, well, you screamed when you saw that plastic spider. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> yeah, ha ha. <laughs> At least they won't bug us tonight. <laughs> Get it? Uh, no. I ran into a web like that when I was a kid. Ew. We could build a really cool fort here, I bet. Not today. Check this out, Sean. Whoa. Nice view. You can see so far. Mm 
No. Come on down. We gotta eat. All right, and I know. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. We make fire. Can I help? Ah. Let me take care of this. I have bigger lungs. And a bigger mouth. I heard that. I didn't say whatever. I, I could have. I wish we had more. I know. Me too. I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. <gasps> yesterday was yesterday. Now that we're out here, we have to do everything ourselves. Right? Okay. But you'll help me if I need it, right? That's what I'm here for. And you gotta help me, too. Wonder if I'll ever go back to school after this. secret base ever. Nobody's gonna find us. <gasps> I'm so over chips. <gasps> I'm so over chips. Look, a full moon. Ooh. <laughs> it's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? <laughs> of course there are, but they're no match for us. How do you know? What if they come here? Oh! Bring it on! Sean? Come on. I'm kidding. We'll be safe here. You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? I don't remember everything. It's not your fault. Shit happens. Brett deserved it. Why can't I remember? It's weird. Um, don't worry, dude. You were running around all day. You tired out. It happens. Nice, Sean. Oh. Yours are exactly what we needed for survival. Oh, 
Oh, you look tired. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet hurt. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. <sighs> better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Yeah, you were like a... a real wilderness expert. Um, that's cool. Why is one day off in your son? Sleep tight, bro. Hey, bro, wake up. Huh? Sean? What happened? Where's Dad? It's okay. He, he just had a bad dream. That's all. Sean? I'm scared. I keep hearing noises. Uh, no. No, don't be. Uh, everything's cool. But we're alone. You said there are bears and wolves. They're... They're sleeping, like like we should be. And look, our our fire's still roaring. Daniel, we'll find a better place tomorrow, okay? And food too. I promise. You promise? Promise. Look, it's easier now. We're going downhill. We just gotta keep walking. Yeah. You said things were getting better yesterday. And the day before. I'm sorry, dude. I'm trying my best. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Are you okay? Yeah. No. I was just thinking about when Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry. But he didn't like it. So he said he was going to get us after school. What did you do? He waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. I'm sorry, you know. I should have listened. You never believe me. I regret. Yeah. I know. It's just. 
I'll do better, okay? Yeah. I kind of wish you weren't so mean all the time. I'm trying my best, man. I know it's been tough. Don't worry. I'm not a kid anymore. Hey, there's something ahead. Yep. Must be the gas station we saw on that sun. Shit, my phone's dead. I'll just check it later. Finally. I thought we'd never get out of these woods alive. Awesome. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. We're gonna get food, water, and plus a map. So we can find the best route. All right. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but it's weird. This will be my first Halloween away from home. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but tonight will be better. Last night was so cold. I don't even want to think about ice. Hey, come on. had a thing for gas stations. We stopped at so many on our road trips. He says they're all kind of the same. They feel familiar. Almost like home. Same bad coffee. Same nasty toilets. Same food. But I don't feel at home at all. Something, please? Um, yeah. Sorry. Just daydreaming. Okay. Let's go. Oh, shit, they're still looking for us. We can't go back. Can't let Daniel know. Not right now. Like a regular holiday trip. R O P A N E. Yeah, we're not from around here. Get over it. Hey, hi. Good evening. Yes, can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. Oh, we're on a, a road trip. Looks like you went through a mud flow. Oh, uh, we went on a big hike and fell. A lot. So where are your parents? Oh, uh, oh, this is just for me and my brother. No parents allowed. By yourselves, all the way out here? We know. We come out here all the time. Just not right here. Hmm, you don't look like everybody else who stops by. Wow, did something interesting happen here? Oh, that's my husband up there. He built this place 30 years ago. Yep. Who's the guy with him? Is that supposed to be someone famous? Yep, that's a famous Hollywood director or something. He made a show up here, but we don't watch TV. Nice man. Don't think he liked our coffee. 
get all that food. Dude. I know. Let's see. We could live in that. But there's no way we can pay for it. No way I can steal something this big. What are you looking at? Oh, hey there. Well, I'm actually doing research. It's, uh, well, get uh get not for you. Why? Like, dirty stuff? Yeah. Just do it, man. Uh, adult stuff. I'm nine years old. What are you doing kind of over there? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you do. What's your name? Daniel. Hey, Daniel. I'm Brody. Why are you looking at adult stuff? For work. Ooh, okay, must be a nice job. Check it out. It's a rat Sorry, dude. You'd had to drag my ass to make me come back here after all this. After last night, hey, I would kill for one that? of these. <sighs> Watch you where you're that. walking. Don't want mud all over my store. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah, I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. I think that's it. Okie dokie. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. What's your name, huh? Great. Daniel's gonna be all over that puppy. Yeah, it's a dog. Oh, a puppy! Sure. Super cute doggy. You ready? Is this yours? No, just another stray mutt. Aw, he must be sad. What's his name? That's a she. Oh, right. Oh, can we have the puppy? Please? Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah. It would be so cool. Come on. We need adults to take care of her, not kids. I know. I just thought we could. I'd love to. She's right. We can't take care of a dog right now. Who sends postcards? Boring. Pretty sweet. I'm Daniel. So what exactly are you doing all the way out here? It's a secret adventure. Is that so? Sounds intriguing. Did you make all these bears? Oh, no. I won't take any credit for the bears. That's all on my husband. <gasps> nah. Stop making
She keeps looking at me. No I can't go wrong with these. I think they're so cute. Well, good for you. Sure glad somebody does. Man, um, can you go talk to her? Uh, just ask her stuff uh, like you always do. Uh, why? So I can shop alone. Sean, you better not steal again. You better not. Shh, watch it. Just bug her, okay? Please. Jeez, okay. But you better be careful. Um, hi. <sighs> okay. She's focused on Daniel. Hurry up, dude. Before she busts you. Why? I don't know. I want to know how those tiny pumps can hold so much gasoline. Oh, I see. Well... We have these big tanks underground that hold all the fuel. Uh, so, how do you get the gas in and out? With big tanker trucks. You've seen those before, right? Uh, yeah. My dad haunts at them when they get in the way at the pump. And trusses. So now you know the whole story. That's uh, Jeez, cool. Dad that would have loved this so much. Have you... have... Gas station. I'm a little busy right now working. So excuse me. Oh, right. Uh, sorry. Dude, calm down. What is it? Power Bear Claw? Uh, can we play? I bet it's easy to get a prize. Yeah, no. See all those prizes still inside? Nobody wins, except the machine. Oh. Uh, but hey, we're the Wolf Brothers. Us teach this machine a lesson, right? Yes. So, who goes first? Go get him, little brother. No one can defeat. Ooh, I'm gonna beat this boss. Let's go, Power Bear Claw. Wait till you get a good opening. Not there. It sucks. Don't grab so fast. This is hard. Uh, can you try? Yeah, okay. Let's see what I can do. Yeah! Let me get in the zone. Here we go. Almost! Beware can I play? Please, please, please. Sorry, buddy. We can't waste money on that kind of stuff right now. What? That's it? Yeah, I told you. Come on. Let's not waste time on that stupid thing. Not there. I just want one little power bear. I know, Daniel. But look, we're already surrounded by bears. Right. I'll just bust out my platinum card. Uh, excuse me. You gonna pay for that? Uh, 
Oh, my bad. Sorry. She was so cute. Okay, do not put on that. Can't help her. What else do we have? Okay, got it. That's the grand total. There you go. Thanks much. All right, here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Let's grab it and check out this map. All right, time to plan our next stop. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see, what do we got here? This is a ton of food. I thought we were broke. Not today, man. So let's grub out. This is our truck. Really? You got me a choco crisp? Of course I did. You deserved it. Are you guys lost? Uh, nah. We're good. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. <sighs> yeah, hope I can read it. Is this supposed to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday. But it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. Definitely not there. All right. This is it. Are you sure? <sighs> yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so... Can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? Aww. But it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. Hey, kids. Looks like you're out camping. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just... hope you pay for all that. We don't tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir, we paid for this, and the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. Nope. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Uh, excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it, it's okay. Look, our, our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me! Don't do it, boy! Let go! Uh, Don't touch my brother!
what the fuck? Where am I? Oh shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? It hurts. I didn't pop you that hard. You're all right. I, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Just let me use the bathroom. Nice try. But I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Well, the shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. Did you touch him? You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leaving him out in the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. Turn the lights off. Fuck. Daniel must be scared shitless. I can't leave him out there. Come on. It's only plastic. Looks like he's gone for now. Daniel? I'm right here. Are, are you okay? I, I, I'm good. That old guy chased me into the woods, but uh, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Emmanuel, you're doing great. We totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. They call the cops on us. I'm sorry, but you married an asshole. Can you try and open this vent? Don't worry. We'll figure something out. I don't even want to think of this asshole reading the same magazines as dad. Oh yeah. 
This racist shithead is a real pillar of the community, all right. Looks like he's gone for now. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. It is, but be careful, it might attract him. <sighs> so close, but yet too fucking far. Okay, looks like he's gone for now. Hey, you think he can open the back door? Why did I put us in this situation? It's not helping. It's locked. What? Of course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Sean, is everything all right? Yeah. But don't worry. I'm almost there. Right. I need something to break this shit. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. I, I think I saw a big file thing in the workshop with all those bear sculptures. I know you can find it. This is it. You rule, Daniel. Come on. Let's do this. Yes. Good job, bro. I'm still here. Come on, you mother. Yes. Score. Kid, can you do it? Here, here. Come on. so scared. Holy shit. Did that mother... Did that asshole hit you? Did he? No. He tried to grab me, but I got away. Okay. We need to cut this off. Fast. How about these? Dude, you rock. What happened? What? What did you do? I, I don't know. I don't know what happened. 
It's okay. You're safe now. You fucking little spick. You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your life. The hell with you. I told you to leave us alone. Sean, what are you doing? Daniel, come on. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Come on! Wait! Shit! Where are we going? Sean! Watch out! Over there! Uh, let's go! I don't know! in the woods. Get in, you too. Hurry up before he catches us. having a shit day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Did he mess with you too? He started to earlier, but I bought too much stuff just to piss him off. Welcome to Redneck Land. The same Seattle no more. We only lived in one place my whole life. It's kind of lame, but... Well, you're pretty young. You have time. That's what's great about traveling. It gives you perspective. Sometimes maybe too much. Well, don't let it fade, you little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <laughs> What's under the blanket? Come on, I'm not stupid. <sighs> Daniel. What? The secret. <laughs> We're heroes. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But... Uh couldn't leave her with those mean people. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. She's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. <sighs> just, just, just stop. <sighs> you win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. She's gonna be so quiet. And, and, and what should we name her? Hey. Your dog, your choice. Oh, cool. Let's see. Um, mm, how about uh, mushroom? She totally looks like a mushroom. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Not much of a girl's name, though. Who cares? I'm sure she loves it. So do I. <laughs> All right. Mushroom it is, then. 
<laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dude. <laughs> Sounds like you've been on the road for a long time. Long, boring story short, I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Eh, whatever. Wow. So you're like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Are you, like, famous or something? <laughs> More like, or something. People in my network know who I am and vice versa. Oh, that's enough for me. <laughs> Sounds pretty awesome. <laughs> I kind of wish I was famous, too. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah. And feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? Your pitch of driving? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. It was all my fault. 
Daniel wanted to play spot on me, and of course I told him to get lost, and our asshole neighbor was picking on him, and I freaked out. So Dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops, and they killed my dad in front of me. It's all my fucking fault. All I had to do was play with Daniel, and Dad would still be alive. I fucked up my whole family, and now we're alone. Hey, it's gonna be all right. Take a deep breath. Listen, it's not your fault. You don't have control over all this stuff. You can't blame yourself for everything that happens in this world. You're gonna be okay, Sean. How? My life feels like, like that town down there. Wiped out, destroyed. Empty. Like I have nothing. What is sure is, that's the past. But you can't look back now. We've got each other. And you have to move forward. Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next time, I guess. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Good question. I was thinking... Get out of the country? Fuck it, go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn. I thought I was the long-haul traveler. Maybe this is crazy, but should we just keep going till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the U.S. Except for grandparents. We don't see anymore. What about your mom? No. No way. She's... Out of the picture. But Dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Rico. That's a pretty cool name. So it's got to be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves.
tame mushroom. You can chase me. Then try. Uh, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! We're so lucky Brody helped us. If it wasn't for him, we... Glad to see him act like a kid again. How will I tell him? Too bad sandcastles never last. I guess I could play a little with these two. Hey, let's play fetch with the puff. Really? Yes. Let me do a test throw first. Cool? Well, okay, but I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Come on, mushroom. Get it. Go, mushroom. <laughs> Good doggy. I think we need a frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. You go for it. Just don't throw it too far. I won't. I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. Get that stick. Looks like these two are getting along. It's good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay, but you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Okay. You can always get a burner later. Trust me. And Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Brody, to... you're not leaving, are you? Yes, I am, but... Not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean, ho, ho, ho.
And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay. You win. Thanks, Brody. Feels good. Here, looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. Wish you could stay with us. Me too, kid. Uh, sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. Okay. Time to hit the sack. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. Okay. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. Shouldn't have any trouble from them. Do you think it will have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If we're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. throw you in cave boy we can watch TV too and there's a balcony whoa this is nice and warm oh this bed is soft what about this one uh not bad but too far from the TV can I take the one in front of the TV huh Want to play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, bud. Ready? I am so ready to beat you. Aw, shoot. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. Sure, I mean, you're gonna lose again, but suit yourself. Not this time. Aw, come on. Not fair. You lost, man. What's not fair? I wanted that bed. Eh, take it. For real? I don't really care. Awesome. They're the same, you know? Yeah, but I like this one better. All right, I'm gonna run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, pig pen. I wouldn't be so sure, cave boy. I'll call you when it's ready. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. Oh, cool. Hot dog man is on. Oh, I yeah. remember this 
episode? Wish we still had Brody around. Thanks for everything, Brody. I'll be extra careful. Oh, shit, that was wild. We have a tent now. <laughs> yeah, don't think we'll be coming back this way. Hey. Can you turn that down, please? Aww. Okay, okay. I used to be all over that show, too. At least it's keeping Daniel busy. I tried to iron my shirts once. Burned a hole through them. <laughs> I can see why they left that tie. A cheap souvenir for a cheap trip. Makes sense. This episode is awesome. You should sit down and watch it with me. This cigarette with Lila seems so far away. Nice out here. Wish I cared. Puerto Lobos, Mexico. Can I get us this far? And safe? How can we get there without money? And Daniel still doesn't know what really happened. What the fuck am I gonna tell him? Me and Danny will just have to take it one step at a time. a serious bong rip right now. Brody gave us some cash so we can take one of these tomorrow. They're headed south. Nothing better than drawing to clear my head after this mess. Okay, got it. So, what's up? The buns want to catch hot dog man and turn him into sausage meat. Oh yeah. The giant meatball attacks in the next episode, right? Yes. And they get to meet the city mayo. Man, it's been ages. Why don't you watch Hot Dog Man with me anymore? I'm too old, dude. 
And I've seen it so many times. <laughs> okay, Grandpa Sean. Feels so good to sit down and watch TV. <laughs> True. Watch out for Grandpa Sean! <laughs> Stop! Sean! <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Next time, you'll respect the old man. Okay, I'm done here. You're missing the best part. I know, but I gotta take care of the bat. Don't forget you're up soon. I know. Let's put this in the bathroom for Prince Daniel. She's so sweet. Right, Sean? A real bad. I can't believe I'm that happy to stay at a motel. Damn. I could paint this shit. I miss GPS already. But at least we're progressing south. No worries. We don't have to build a fire tonight. Daniel, you have towels in the bathroom. Don't forget to use yeah, them. Yeah. Time to be a kid again. Man, this hot water's going to feel so good. Fill her up. It's a condom in my bag. Gross. Hey, don't touch that. Dude, you really look like shit. Bet he won't hate taking a bath after this. He needs that heat. Man, this hot water's going to feel so good. You ready? Aw, the episode's almost finished. Nice try. The water's hot. Come on. Okay, I'm going. What's warm? Why didn't you use soap to make bubbles? Sorry, man, I forgot to. Use as much soap as you want. It's free. Oh, everything? Cool. Yeah, clean up good. But leave some for me, bro. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. He'd freak out if he saw me. Time to say goodbye to modern life.
Lily's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this, or she'll get into trouble too. Hey, Lila. Sean, is that you? <laughs> Do you... Sean! Oh, God. Are you okay? I guess. I'm... I'm in a motel. With Daniel. <laughs> Shit! Everyone's looking for you here. How about you? Are you okay? No. Everything's fucked up. I'm so worried about you. The cops are talking to everybody at school. This is a nightmare. We're fucked. Sean, don't say that. It will be okay. I miss you so much. Maybe you could come back. You know I wish I could, but... We can't take that risk. They're, they're gonna put me in juvie. And Daniel... Oh, shit. And I've got your back, no matter what. No way. I'm not gonna let you get in trouble for me. Stop acting like I'm never gonna see you again. That's bullshit. I'm sorry. I totally hate this. I guess the freaking fighters are disbanded for a while. Shit actually changes, I guess. So... <laughs> Um, we're just going away for now. I'll call you if I get a chance. I miss you, Lila. Sean, wait. Okay, don't think about it. Just tell Daniel the truth. Are you kidding me? Remember that song? Come on, dance! Man, I, I can't dance right now. My legs are thrashed. Sorry. You're no fun. Daniel, uh... Come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a Coke. Or something. Okay. I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal?
Daniel. Oh my god! Daniel! What's happening? Daniel, calm down! You lied! Dad! Your dad is dead! Why? It, it was an accident! A, a cop fucked up and shot him! That's it! I'm sorry. I just... Just don't lie to me ever again. Ever. I promise I won't lie to you again. I promise. I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. What are we gonna do without him? Shh. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. Sean. Am I? A monster? Nothing is wrong with you. You're... different. Okay. What are we gonna do now? I was thinking... maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where Dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. He used to tell me bedtime stories, too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa. They all lived happily together. Oh. Mm -hmm. 